Hi, welcome to the November edition of Scandalous Scarves. I'm drowning in scarves and hats here. It took me a long time to set up, so let me get started. I am wearing Dana, which is a cotton scarf. And there's a nice fringe on it. It is obviously striped. Cotton's knife is nice because it breathes. This is not a super warm scarf. So it's for a warmer day, maybe an afternoon or something. But as you see, we've got brown and coral and peach and kind of an ivory. And it is a little bit, it's got kind of a distressed look to it. So you can see in the brown that it's got some variations of shade here. And that's deliberate. It's not worn or anything. So this is Dana cotton stripe. This is Poseidon. This is a bodacious boa. It's quite long. It's probably close to eight feet long. Eyelash yarn, which is acrylic, and it's, it's, it's very fuzzy, nice and really cozy. <laughs> And these scarves I'm showing you right now don't have matching hats. This year I've been trying to have more sets. Um, and I sell them separately because some people just need scarves and some people just need hats. Um, so you can do either whatever you need to do. I've also um, done some sets that have maybe a couple different hats would match the scarf or Actually, I'm going to show you a hat that would match two different scarves, and you can choose, you know, I just think it's fun to be able to mix and match because everybody has their own idea of what they want to wear, of course. So that was Poseidon. This is Egg Salad by the Sea. This does have a coordinating yellow hat. It's got the same, uh, this is cotton yarn. And the coordinating hat is kind of the darker yellow and white. So this has blue on it. So it would be really pretty if you had a like a denim jacket and you were wearing the scarf to pick up on the blue in the jacket and then you'd wear the yellow hat. There's sort of a distance. You know, it's not an exact match, but it's kind of, it's, it would be a neat effect. Um, the other hat, has a coordinate has a matching scarf exactly the same so that could be a lot of yellow for somebody you know so this might be a nice compromise this is very long this is oh at least seven feet and it does have a good bit of blue in it it's, again it's called egg salad by the sea it is cotton so it's breathable it's double stranded so it, it has some weight to it, but it's not super warm. But you can really, you can really have some fun. There's a lot of scarf to work with here, which I think is neat. So that is Egg Salad by the Sea. I try to make the names <clears throat> kind of fit with each other so you can tell it's part of a set so egg salad and egg salad by the sea that'll kind of be a cue so you know oh maybe they kind of they go, they must go together or they can go together they don't have to go together this is the mega scarf it's wool and you can really it's nice and long so you can really bundle up in it this is probably I think one of probably about the warmest scarf I have and it's very I love the colors it's magenta and gold and kind of a I would guess that's sort of a jade green it's got it's got a bluish tinge to it but see it's kind of got like a zigzaggy pattern in there pretty neat scarf so that's a really nice one to bundle up in And it is wool. So 
you might be able to get it dry cleaned or just generally to wash any of these the safest thing is woolite in the sink and just let it lie flat like on a sweater rack or something and just give it plenty of time to just air dry i wouldn't if you if you put them in the washing machine you're gonna have problems because i washed a, a cotton one once in the washing machine and it frayed the fringe and it was just a cotton one of course wool will shrink in hot water so you end up with felt <laughs> you know so you just just I just say play it safe and, and you know throw the wool eye on there in the bathroom sink let it soak and you know you're, you'll be good to go play it safe this is Hetty and she's wearing cookie cookie is going to have a matching scarf and there will be another video about unfinished projects just so you know what's going on Cookie won't be listed on the website until this matching scarf is finished. So this is a sneak preview, but I just thought it was really pretty. I like the, the browns in it. Good for somebody who's got dark hair, especially. Let's see. So now I'm getting to some my friends are helping me out here. We have Mindy Peppermint. Come on, Mindy. My colleague. Ugh. There you are. Hey, Mindy. Hi. Hi, everybody. Hey, I'm wearing a different hat this time. Yeah, let's see if we can get to this way. How's this? Oh yeah, this is good because I could just sort of stand out and lean against you. I like it. Yeah, I like it too. What are you wearing? I'm wearing turtles, which I think that's kind of a new one, isn't it? The hat's been around a while. The scarf hasn't been finished yet. Oh. I'm not sure I had it in the last, had pebbles in the last video. I don't think you did. Oh, okay. This is very pretty. It's um, kind of got a rainbow effect. It looks gray from a distance, but when you get up close to it, you'll see all the different colors in it. And I thought it would be pretty with Mindy's hair because there's, let's see, I'm just going to call out some of the colors I see pink and green and gray and sort of a purpley there's aqua and some kind of orange i mean all kinds of colors are in here uh, this is double stranded all the hats are that's right good point for structure right that's right for structure yep and it's kind of a double yard Right, it is. Yeah. And you can see the back. See, doesn't it look pretty with her hair? Okay, thanks a lot, Mindy. Thank you, and thank you for not sticking me with that same uh, the hat you always stick me with. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Okay, that's Mindy. Here's one of my favorites. This is this scarf. You know, I guess it's about six and a half feet long and it's been getting a lot of attention. This is called Birchwood. People say, oh, I'm looking for one with fall colors. And that's definitely Birchwood. It's an acrylic. It's a jacquard pattern. Um, it's just printed. The yarn is just printed. I mean, it's very simple to do. I shouldn't tell, tell you even, <laughs> but it, it is. And you see the fringe. So you've got, um, gosh, it's shades of green with some brown and there's sort of um, an ivory and there's gold here. There's this really pretty 
kind of a light olive green here. That's one of the colors I like in it. And this is knit in a seed stitch. And it's acrylic. It's not very heavy weight. And I have somebody helping me with the matching hat. This is Tasha. How you doing, Tasha? Oh, yeah. Hi, how are you? I'm getting there. Hey, God. Hey. Hey. Hey, like, thank you for not making me wear, like, yellow again. I mean, like, I really love yellow. But it's like, I just was kind of over yellowed. <laughs> Too much mellow yellow. Yeah, I, I just sort of, I like the green. That's cool. Look at the scarf. This is that gorgeous. Yeah, I like that. It's really total. Yeah, I'm Tasha. Then I'm wearing Dirtwood hat. Can I show you the deck? Yeah, that's pretty. So you have like you have like a set um you can like dye one or those, whichever you like would prefer to do. And because uh, some people like like she was saying, some people don't like to wear don't, don't like scars and some people don't like hats. So you could just buy what you need or you could either dye the set and get half of it to set away for like Christmas or something. Yeah, that's an idea. Because you'd save on shipping if you buy both of them. Yeah, yeah, that does look pretty with your brown eyes. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, so this is um, Tasha and this is the Birchwood set, which you can buy together or individually. Thank you very much, Tasha. Oh, you're welcome. Later, dudes. <laughs> Later, dudes. Okay. Okay, that's Birchwood. Oh, excuse me. Now, I was talking about egg salad by the sea earlier. Okay, here is egg salad. This is cotton. And it, as you can see, this is that yellow. This is a darker shade of yellow in here. The other one has a couple different shades of yellow. You know, there's more color in um, I See the Sea. Excuse me, Egg Salad by the Sea. There's more color in Egg Salad by the Sea. Here is Egg Salad by the Sea again so that you can have them next to each other. See it? Is you've got this yellow and it coordinates but it's nice to kind of have the blue to break up all the yellow otherwise you might be wearing if you were assuming you get the egg salad hat you've got this here and this down here and that's a lot of yellow so this would be a good alternative um, this is because this is single strand, it's lighter weight. So this is a very lightweight cotton scarf. And my friend Winter is going to show you the egg salad hat. Yeah, hello, hello. Yeah, everybody, I just followed my sister, didn't I? Yes, you did. You might think we're the same person. A lot of people do until they see us together. And then they say, are you twins? <laughs> do they? Yeah. But we're not twins. I'm four years younger than Tasha. Tasha's very beautiful. Tasha, um, to tell them apart, actually has kind of a... A different nose yeah she does and um, obviously she just wears different clothes and I don't know you, you could get to you tell them apart eventually yes and I speak strangely <laughs> I thought Tasha spoke strangely well I don't I don't know I don't talk the way she does I thought I was the one that spoke strangely <laughs> I don't I don't know winter Anyway, I thought you would look cute in the egg salad hat. 
and it goes better with your and we were having trouble before about things clashing with her beautiful shirt there yes i love my shirt it's very pretty but yes you're right this is a much better color combination because it's not too printy printy yes okay well this is the nice egg salad hat and it is cotton so it's not very heavy okay thanks winter no thank you thank you everyone let's see now we have kind of an interesting setup that oh how am i going to work with this i've got i guess i'll wear this hat this is a brand new hat this is called grape c Still, I don't have enough heads for this. So, but, uh, now, we've got Hetty here wearing I See the Sea. Okay. And this is Grape Sea. And this is Groovy Grapes. And like I said, I don't have enough heads. But if you look at it, see, I See the Sea has been combined with Groovy Grapes to create Grape Sea, okay? Because we are doing mix and match. So you can have, you can get the Grape Sea hat and then you can get the Groovy Grapes scarf because they are made to coordinate or you can get the I see the sea scarf to wear with grape C or you can be matchy matchy and wear the I see the sea hat with the I see the sea scarf Or, <laughs> I have out clevered myself here. <laughs> or, or, or you can get the Groovy Grapes scarf with the Groovy Grapes hat. So we've got three different hats to go with two scarves. And the names help you out. Grape C. Groovy Grapes. And I see the C equals Grape C. <laughs> Whew, exhausting, isn't it? <laughs> okay, and this is... These are acrylic scarves. They do not have fringes. They are subtly striped. They're kind of a nubby, I guess kind of a boucle. They are um, pretty warm, but they don't have a lot. They're not, they're not heavy to wear because it's, it's acrylic. So it doesn't, it doesn't breathe the way, you know, cotton does. So it, but it will keep you warm. Now I've got, we're almost done. Two more. Who's this cute kid? Me. Hi, Mom. Hi, Summer. How are you? I'm good. What one is this? This is Blue Jay. Oh, yeah. I like this one. This is nice. It's pretty with your eyes. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. Here's my summer. Hiya, 
everybody, I'm Sandra and I'm wearing the blue jay hat. See, it's made of wool and it's double strands. And mom's got the neat scarf that matches it. Yeah, this is a weird scarf because it's gray and blue on one half and blue and gray on the other half. And it's wool and it's nice and long but wool will keep you warm and it doesn't weigh a ton so that's nice some of these scarves can get just kind of you know heavy <laughs> it can be a lot to lug around yeah you like your hat yeah i like my hat i like that it's too tall yeah, it's actually, it's a marled scarf, so that the, there's two, two shades of gray in the gray, gray sections, almost looks like white, and then two shades of blue in the blue piece. And this is called Blue Jay after the bird. Are we done? Just almost. I've got one set I have to put on, so I'll meet you in a little bit. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. See you later. See you later, alligator. Okay, here's the last set. This is called Pretty Darn Cute, and it's pink and brown and blue. And it's the jacquard. It's about six feet long same family as birchwood it's got the same jacquard print this would be pretty if you have dark hair and blue eyes it'd be very pretty um, of course you can wear it with pink it'd be pretty also with denim or dark brown um, this it's interesting because it's got kind of a printed section here which I think is makes it unique so it's it's the pink and brown version of birchwood and it's called pretty darn cute and that is all of my my lovelies for this month uh, except for the all of my finished ones so pop on over to the to the shop and treat yourself to a nice handmade hat and or scarf and thank you so much for coming over and watching